And let's move now to a story with ties to a Michigan college, one of the most famous sculptures in Italy, in fact, in all the world, yeah. and a small charter school in Florida. And it all surrounds teaching children about Michelangelo's iconic sculpture of David. Grant Herms joins us now live with the latest and also to help explain exactly what's going on here. Grant? Yeah, Karen, Devin, this is one of the weirder ones, right? So this is a controversy from that small school in Florida that fired a principal after students were shown the statue of David in an art class. And that school uses Hillsdale College's curriculum and Hillsdale now saying this is not what they had in mind. The controversy was over a single photo, just like this one, of the most famous sculpture in the world, Michelangelo's The David. During an art class lesson, the teacher showed a sixth grade class at Tallahassee Classical School a picture of the statue. But then parents began to complain they hadn't been given advance notice of the lesson against new school policy. One parent even called the statue pornography. After complaints, the principal of the school was fired. Then late this week, Hillsdale College saying it would be cutting ties with the school. The conservative college says the license for Tallahassee Classical will expire at the end of the school year. In a release, the college saying this drama around teaching Michelangelo's David sculpture, one of the most important works of art in existence, has become a distraction from and a parody of the actual aims of classical education. Of course, Hillsdale's K-12 art curriculum includes Michelangelo's David and other works of art that depict the human form. According to the school's website, Hillsdale's curriculum focuses on civic virtues and moral character, but has been criticized as incomplete and revisionist. It's also considered a direct response to modern Modern schooling, which the college's president has called a plague. In response to losing their license, Tallahassee Classical's board saying in part, parents do not dictate what is taught at Tallahassee Classical, but they have every right to know exactly what their children are being taught, and the board is going to ensure that their rights are consistently and without fail adhered to. Not a little twist of irony, the Tallahassee Classical School Board president told Slate Magazine this week that they were just following the lead of Florida Governor Ron DeSantis. DeSantis was actually a featured speaker at Hillsdale talking about education last year, and he was now going to be speaking again in Michigan next week. Back to you. Obviously, lots of folks watching this one, Grant. So what happens to the school in Florida now? Well, Karen, they're going to have to get new curriculum for next school year. Now, there is a chance that Hillsdale could give them back their license once all of this public scrutiny dies down. But for right now, they're going to have to find new books and new lessons for kids next year. Wow. To you. All right. Thank you, Grant.